So A major has a key signature of three sharps. Can you name them in the correct order? It is... But in the correct order, this is exactly uh, always right. how we have to name yeah. them, right? So, what so is the it order? It would be. Wait. Oh, yeah. It does say. Mm -hmm. F, C, and G. G. F, C, and G. Remember, we learned a little mnemonic for those sharps. Fine clothes get dirty. Always. Except blue jeans. Or I might have tell you Father Charles goes down and it ends battle. Okay, so Father Charles goes down, right? So if we have only three sharps, Father Charles goes. Oh. See, that's a good way to remember the sharps. Yes. All right, so hide and seek. Oh my gosh, there's so much staccato in the first line. And then how is the second line different than the first line? It has legato. All right. So there are two touch releases we're going to use. First, the little woodpecker, right? is where your wrist and your forearm stay level with each other. Good. And then how is the push-off touch release different than the woodpecker? And let your wrist come up or forward first. That's it. Good. That's it. And it doesn't have to be far up into the air, into the space, but just a little bit. Yes. There you go. Good. All right. And you can do the same thing with your left hand, right? When you get to both of those chords, we'll both be push-ups. Okay, let's try it from the beginning.